First, I'd like to welcome everybody. Thank you all for being here to witness this momentous occasion. It's not an accident that all of you are invited to be here today. Everyone here represents someone important to the individual and collective lives of Yishvan and Lizzie. And honestly, I can't think of a better place for these two to be bound in Holy Union. Driving on the right side of the line <laughs> and kiss you yet? I mean, please, for God. It's so beautiful. <laughs> it is windy. <laughs> Do you like my dress? <laughs> I love your dress. <laughs> beautiful, you are. Are you ready to get married? You ready to do this thing? What, marry you? Yeah. Yeah. I'm in for it. Give us a spin. One of the most remarkable moments in life is when you meet a person who makes you feel complete. A person who makes the world a more beautiful place. You share such a special bond that it transcends normal relationships and becomes something pure. It becomes wonderful, to the point where you can't imagine spending another day without them. For Ishvan, it happened about 10 years ago when he met Liz working at the St. Julian. And even though she thought he was cute, Ishvan was too slow to realize that, so he instantly put himself in the friend zone. It only took a few years, and Liz showing up in one of our 4th of July backyard redneck bashes. Where the flames were ignited. They weren't roaring yet, but ignited. And they started thinking like, hmm, like maybe this is more than just a friendship. And on their first real date to Flume at Red Rocks. And that's where the flames were flying high, and Liz put the moves on Ishvan. She started this whole thing. Liz, even with all of my indecisive tendencies, I stand before you, ready to make the easiest decision of my life. It amazes me that I finally get to marry my best friend. The fact that I'm able to connect with the most loving, beautiful, and honest person I know is such a blessing. I promise to be your best friend partner in crime, adventure, and to create the most epic memories together. I will always protect you and lift your spirits when you're down. I'll always be the man of the household and never let your energy be anything less than positive and loving. The happiness and joy that you've brought to my life has helped me get through some of the most trying times. If it wasn't for you, I would not be the man standing in front of you today. Without hesitation, I am unconditionally selfless for you. I will never put you in a situation where you do not feel loved or supported. Liz, you're my best friend, my almost wife, and the mother of our future children. I love you so much. Uh, but I've been blessed with the honor of standing up here today and marrying two of my best friends and two of the best people that I've ever known. Ishvan, you are my everything. You are my soulmate, the love of my life, my partner and my best friend. I feel like the luckiest woman in the world to have found a man who makes me smile and laugh every single day like you do. Even on the toughest of days. We are better together as one unit. You are home to me. You bring out a side of me that I did not know existed before we met. A side of me that's more confident, empowered, adventurous, goofy, and childlike. You have taught me that life is too short not to live in the moment and to laugh every step of the way. Life is so fun with you. From this day forward, you will be the first person I see when I wake up in the morning and the last person I see before I go to bed. This is the greatest blessing that God has given me. I love you so much, you I love you. 
love you more than any argument we will ever have. I love you more than any obstacle that may come between us. I love you more than every hardship we will face. Together, we will create a beautiful family and build our dream future. I promise that I will be an amazing mother to our children and make sure they know how much I love their father. I promise to always stand by your side to support you and defend you. I promise to prioritize you and our family before everything. I promise to be open-minded to new adventures, even if it's outside of my comfort zone. <laughs> I promise to continue embarrassing you with my bad jokes <laughs> and be the one who laughs the hardest at yours. I promise to put work into our relationship every day and make sure you have everything that my heart has to offer. We will grow old together, but I will always look at you the same way that I do today. I love you today, every day for the rest of my life. Can I kiss you again? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> In a minute. A little later. <laughs> okay. Give it, give it a sec. Okay. We'll get to that. I promise to scare you a little less than I already do. <laughs> but we both know that won't happen. So instead, I'll make some promises that I can keep. <laughs> I promise to put Danny's well-being over my own, <laughs> especially when there's thunder. <laughs> I promise to always have your back and agree with mostly everything you say. <laughs> I promise to always help you correct people with your new last name spelling. <laughs> I'll always laugh at your terrible jokes just to make you have the accomplishment of being funny. I know that we've all been looking forward to this night for a long time. Some of us for months and some of us for years. But no one has been looking forward to it longer than Jerry and Debbie. Jerry, 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 Jerry. Despite having 30 years to prepare for the father of the bride speech, um, I stand to hear speech this it just how stunning you are. You're truly beautiful, and um, I always think that from the heart that you're my little girl, you always will be. For years now, this gorgeous Italian and Hungarian have been moving mountains together. Through the fun and the easy times, through the dark and the more trying, this pair was set off to accomplish great things from the very start. And Liz, I'm realizing that you also fit into this description of each fun and I. <laughs> No, you, you truly are the best and you're so inspiring. I never thought I could have a friend as wonderful as Liz. Liz is the kind of person that you are just so lucky to have in your life. One of the many things that I admire about Liz is her drive. She's so driven, she's so motivated, and when she puts her mind to something, she makes it happen. She doesn't let anyone change her mind. She's a loyal and loving friend. She's determined and hardworking. She's a powerhouse commercial real estate broker in Boulder in a heavily male-dominated industry. She's a badass. And I feel so lucky to be a part of her life and watching her grow into this amazing woman she is today. I couldn't imagine a better guy than Ishvan to get to marry my soulmate. I've been lucky over the last five years to watch Liz and Ishvan's relationship grow. Their relationship is built on a strong foundation of trust, respect, and humor. They support each other's dreams, they encourage each other's growth, and they take comfort in each other's presence. They help each other in ways that are obvious, yet unnoticed, but always appreciated. I have no doubt that their future together will continue to build upon this strong foundation, and their opportunities together are endless. 
With strong love and resolve comes a bountiful and never-ending life of prosperity. And it will be full of moments that we all wish would never end. They continue to make each other smile and grow beyond the bounds of life, love, and success. You just know when two people are in love. One thing that was throwing us off is that years went by, six years? We dated for six years? And yeah, it, 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 finally I got the call that he wanted to come up and talk to us. Comes up to the cabin and sat down, and sure enough, he wanted to marry my daughter. My first reaction was, what the hell took you so long? But I let him talk, and he explained that he really wanted to make sure that he can provide Lizzie with the kind of life she wanted. And not very many men, I think, do that sometimes. I knew right then he was son-in-law material, and he would make a really good Sicilian. So... Here we are, six years later. Having observed the depth of their love, I am privileged to be here with you as they turn the page into the next chapter of their story. All right, now, now to the fun part. Let's get these kids married, huh? <laughs> All right, Liz. Do you take Ishvan to be your husband? Do you promise to love, honor, cherish, and protect him, forsaking all others and holding only unto him forevermore? I do. As a sign of my love, I have chosen you above all else. With this ring, I be wed. If you take Liz to be your wife, you promise to honor, to love, and cherish, and protect her, forsaking all others, and holding only unto her forevermore. I do. To make your relationship work, it will take patience. You must continue to date each other, show dedication, learn and grow together. It will take loyalty to go forward and together without knowing exactly what the future holds. It will take commitment to hold true to the journey that you have both pledged today. And now, by the power invested in me, by the internet, <laughs> it is my honor to declare you husband and wife. Now you can kiss her. Again? <laughs> Thank everybody for coming tonight. I, I, from my heart, I can't tell you how much it means to us. First and foremost, I want to say how absolutely radiant and breathtaking you look tonight. Can we all give Liz a round of applause? You brought me a lot of joy. I never thought possible. You made me laugh, cry, worry, drain my bank account. But, <laughs> But I let all that stuff go. 13 years of father-daughter dances. 13 years of practicing leading up to tonight. And tonight is the ultimate father-daughter event. So it's a special night for me. Our first concert together, do you remember what that was? Uh, Britney Spears. Britney Spears, yeah. <laughs> not, not only was I the only guy there, I think I was the only deadhead there. But it was an awkward night. I know that your marriage will be filled with countless adventure, laughter, and support for one another, and I have no doubt that you will continue to build a life together that is remarkable. So let's raise a glass to Liz and Ishvan, to a love that knows no bounds. May your journey together be as beautiful and remarkable as the both of you. And to Liz and Ishvan, may all sweethearts become married couples, and may all married couples remain sweethearts. Chin chin. 
As they say in Hungarian, Egyesigrada, which means cheers. <laughs> That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Woo!